Hi, you guys. Thank you for joining me here at Audrey's Reading Area. Thank you, thank you. Please do me a favor, hit the subscribe button. Thank you, thank you for subscribing and supporting. Make sure you share these videos so that everybody can enjoy them too. Now, I have a nice book to read today. It's called Love You Forever. Love You Forever. It's written by Robert Munch and it's illustrated by Sheila McGraw. I'm gonna read you a little bit on the back first. It says, love you forever. A young woman holds her newborn son and looks at him lovingly. Softly, she sings to him, I'll love you forever. I'll like you for always. As long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. This is the story of how that little boy goes through the stages of childhood and becomes a man. It, all, it is also about the enduring nature of parents' love and how it crosses generations. Love You Forever is a book that both children and adults will enjoy over and over again, which means you can watch this video over and over and over again and you will always enjoy it. Now, a mother held her new baby and very slowly rocked him back and forth. Back and forth, back and forth. And while she held him, she sang, I'll love you forever, I'll like you for always. As long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. The baby grew. He grew and he grew and he grew. He grew until he was two years old and he ran all around the house. He pulled all the books off the shelves. He pulled all the food out of the refrigerator and he took his mother's watch and flushed it down the toilet. Sometimes his mother would say, this kid is driving me crazy. <laughs> But at nighttime, when that two-year-old was quiet, she opened the door to his room, crawled across the floor, looked up over the side of his bed, and if he was really asleep, she picked him up and rocked him back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. While she rocked him, she sang, I'll love you forever, I'll like you for always, as long as I'm living my baby you'll be. The little boy grew. He grew and he grew and he grew. He grew until he was nine years old and he never wanted to come in for dinner. He never wanted to take a bath. And when grandma visited, he always said bad words. Sometimes his mother wanted to sell him to the zoo. But at nighttime, when he was asleep, the mother quietly opened the door into his room and went across the floor and looked up over the side of the bed. If he was really asleep, she picked up that nine-year-old boy and rocked him back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. And while she rocked him, she sang, I'll love you forever. I'll like you for always. As long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. The boy grew. He grew and he grew and he grew. He grew until he was a teenager, uh-oh, the teenage years. He had strange friends and he wore strange clothes and he listened to strange music. Sometimes his mother felt, felt like she was in a zoo. But at nighttime when that teenager was asleep, the mother opened the door to his room went across the floor and looked up over the side of the bed. If he really was asleep, 
She picked up that great big boy and rocked him back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. While she rocked him, she sang, I'll love you forever. I'll like you for always. As long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. That teenage grew. He grew and he grew and he grew. He grew until he was a grown up man. He left home and got a house across town. But sometimes on dark nights, the mother got into her car and drove across town. If all the lights in her son's house were out, she opened his door and went across the floor and looked up over the side of the bed. If that great big man was really asleep, she picked him up and rocked him back and forth and back and forth, back and forth. And while she rocked him, she sang, I'll love you forever. I'll like you for always. As long as I'm living, my baby, you'll be. I have a friend named Dion that this book reminds me of, him and his mom. They're real close. Well, that mother, she got older. She got older and older and older. One day she called up her son and said, you'd better come see me because I'm very old and sick. Soon her son came to see her. When he came in the door, she tried to sing the song. She sang, I love you forever. I'll like you for always. But she couldn't finish because she was too old and sick. Oh. The son went to his mother. He picked her up and rocked her back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And he sang this song. I'll love you forever. I'll like you for always. As long as I'm living, my mommy, you'll be. When the son came home that night, he stood for a long time at the top of the stairs. Then he went into the room where his very new baby daughter was sleeping. He picked her up in his arms and very slowly rocked her back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And while he rocked her, he sang, I'll love you forever. I'll like you for always. As long as I'm living, my baby, you'll be. The end, a sweet book, such a sweet book about the connection between a mom and his son, the son and his mom, so sweet. Thank you for listening, you guys. Please don't forget, hit subscribe, hit subscribe, and don't also don't forget to watch all the other movies that I have here on my channel at Audrey's Reading Area. Tell everybody about it too, share it, feel free to share it. Thank you. See you next time.